standard fuse cutout barrel. Now, what can you tell me about this one? It's blown, blown. All right. This is the wire that carries the current. When it sees too much current, it burns through and just melts and drops. You come in, you see this thing hanging down, hanging down like this, you know you've got a problem. This wire has seen a fault and has opened up to protect the rest of the system further upstream. This little wire burns through so that you don't have a transformer blow up or the conductor burn through. It's just another safety measure. Now if you open up, this is your fuse barrel cap. The bottom here, you have a little rating for what size fuse it is. Can you see that one? 10. That's 10 amp fuse. You have different ones. You have quick action, you have slow action. The advantages of the quick action is it'll go right out, right away when it sees a fall. The problem with that is you get more nuisance faults. More things just like a branch falling across that happen to trip it out. That for transient fault that probably would have cleared itself in a second anyways. But you have slower action fuses too that take more time. You can throw this in, hop in your truck, think that you have the problem fixed about the time you start that truck up, bam! You hear that cannon go off and that uh, fuse barrel drop back down.